Uh, Terry, can you talk about where, uh, what to do once you get your buffalo? You know, it's got to be processed, and that, and that takes some time. What do you do at that point? Okay, when we take it in, that, that's usually an all-day affair. Uh, again, it's that hour's drive in. We don't uh, we don't even field dress them out in the field at all. We do nothing. We go right out and pick them up and haul them right into the processor. Uh, they field dress for us. They skin. They do it all. And it usually takes one day. If I bring them in uh, before three thirty in the afternoon, they'll, they'll they'll field dress it and skin it uh, yet that day, and then they hang it overnight. And the next day, all day, it takes them to cut it up. And then the following day, it's ready to go. So that day off, there's all kinds of different things to do. First of all, Moorbridge is a pretty neat little area. Uh, it's great scenery and, and a great place just to go visit. The Hawaii Reservoir is right there. So you can go fishing, if, uh, ice fishing as well as, as uh, rod and reel fishing. Excellent fishing out there. On the ranch itself, we have uh, great prairie dog hunting. Uh, numerous towns out there. And you can go shoot prairie dog if you'd like. If you want to stay an extra day or so, uh, we can do a predator hunt. Uh, we have lots of coyotes out there, bobcat and the like. Those do require a reservation license, uh, which is very nominal. Uh, and the, the shooting is great. There's a lot of predators, a lot of coyotes, and a lot of bobcat out in that area as well. Now, as I understand it, is there also a casino hotel in that area? Yes. Uh, there is a casino right there, the Grand River. Uh, uh, and they also have a motel there. Uh, so you can stay right at the casino if you like. They have full restaurant, the whole shop. Uh, very nice done too. It's very clean, very nice, very well taken care of. Very neat. Fantastic. Well, Terry, it's been an absolute pleasure talking with you today. Um, I, I really appreciate you taking the time out of your day to, just to get with me and do this. Uh, is there anything else you wanted to add about, about the hunt? Well, I really not. It, it's really an exceptional hunt. It's something that I tell people when they call me here and we talk about it. This is a an experience as well as it is as it is a hunt. Uh, the experience behind it is just exceptional. I mean, Sitting Bull was on this property. Um, the reservation is there. You'll find all kinds of, of different artifacts, that kind of thing around as well. Uh, the the vistas, the the looks off the tops of the vistas and the like out there are just extraordinary. Uh, it's really spectacular how it's something you will absolutely talk about for the rest of your life. And it's something too that we bring in. We really, and I'm really hard pressed. I love to bring the kids out as well as disabled. Uh, young kids, anywhere from eight, nine years old can come out and shoot a buffalo if they'd like. And same with the disabled. We've done disabled hunts. We can do those as well. And, uh, it, it, it's just spectacular. It's all I can say. It's an experience and a hunt built all in one. And you get to take home a winter supply of meat, which is really a nice touch. All right. Well, thanks again, Terry. Sure appreciate your time. This is Joe Moore with the Native American Tea Company. Thank you for joining us today.